So this question says f of x is equal to 9 fifths x minus 273.15 plus 32. The question goes on to say the function f gives the temperature in degrees Fahrenheit that corresponds to a temperature of x kelvins. If a temperature increased by 2.10 kelvins, right, so x basically plus 2.10, by how much did the temperature increase in degrees Fahrenheit, right? So if this happens, what's the impact on f of x? So that's basically our question. So I'm going to use a strategy here called plug in your own number, right? I want to find out, well, first of all, I'm not provided with a degrees Kelvin because I just have an x here. So I'm going to plug my own number into there, and I'm going to choose the number 273.15. Hopefully you can see the logic in that. By plugging 273.15 in, I will get zero here, right? 273.15, just make sure you can see it, minus 273.15, all become zero. Nine fifths times zero remain zero. And basically, I'll have this scenario. When x is equal to 273.15, f of x is equal to 32, right? All we have left is this 32 here. Now I'm going to apply this. So x plus 2.10, well, the x that I used was 273.15. So my new x would be 275.25, right? Just this value plus the 2.10. So now I want to find out what happens now. What happens if x is that value? So again, I'll erase this so we can see what's going on. If I replaced this x here with 275.25, I already know what I get as a difference here because I only added 2.10 in the first place. So that difference would be 2.10. So my new function would look like this, f of x is equal to 9 fifths, parentheses, 2.10 plus 32. So all that I have left to do was to use my calculator to figure out, well, what is 9 fifths times 2.10 plus 32? What I get there is that f of x is equal to 35.6. So the question says, by how much did the temperature increase? Well, it went from 32 to 35.6. So that's a difference of 3.6. So I don't see 3.6. Let's see here, I see 3.78. So I wonder if I made a small error somewhere. Let's see. Let's try that 9 fifths again. 9 divided by 5 is 1.8 times 2.10 is 3.78. Yes, made a mistake somewhere. Plus... 32 is actually 35.78, not 35.6. Not quite sure how that happened, but, you know, things like this happen when you're taking the actual test. So 35.78 is what this should really be, and therefore the difference between our 32 and our 35.78 should be 3.78, and therefore our correct answer here is choice A.